Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to a really quick video here. This is super exciting. We have these two big ass boxes. We have the uh, Seed of Chucky Tiffany and we have Blends. So this video isn't going to be a review or anything fancy like that. This is going to be mostly unedited except for when I switch dolls or whatever. Um, it's just me taking them out of the box, getting a first impression on them, and then um, I'm going to be cracking them open and then taking the weekend to actually take some time, get the reviews made hopefully early next week, um, and just really get kind of a feel for them and but before I rush that. So this is just just kind of a quick unboxing video because uh, I did get them and I'm really excited. So I have a friend here with me. Hi there. This is my friend. Uh, he has the knife. So um, I'm really excited. I've had these in my house for about an hour. So we're going to go ahead and cut them open. Okay. All right. All right. Let's uh, fucking do this. Uh, this is going to be so exciting with all this silence. But I always get anxious whenever you cut these like this. And I'm afraid you'll. I'm afraid I'm going to stab myself. Uh, never, <laughs> never, never cut towards yourself. That's the rules. Yeah. But you know, in this house, we never play by the rules. Yeah. Cut towards you. So you'll cut towards me. Yeah. Uh, Alright, all right. this one, uh, this is, yeah, this is oh, Tiffany. Alright, alright, alright. They pack, they, they pack these super well. They have like these uh, thick plastic things on the corners. I'm usually not worried. Her box has a couple like, uh, uh, not holes in it, but like dings from getting messed up. Yeah, you can put these right Thank you. Um, ooh, there's the side of her box. Ooh, okay. Um, but no, no damage to the actual doll. They layer of cardboard and all that good stuff. So, ooh. Okay, I don't know what side is the front, so help me with this. Grab uh, that end right there, the plastic, and we'll just try and lift her out. Oh, I can't even see her. <clears throat> can't even. All right. Let's All right. Set, let's uh let's take her and set her up right here. I'm just being selfish now. I was just staring at her, but here we have Tiffany. She is in her plastic wrap. I'll take that off before the end of the video to show both of them, but. Here she is with a terrible glare from one of my windows. Sorry about that. Ooh. She looks wonderful though. Um, I have to say, I, I know I made that video I talked about, not a critique or anything, uh, uh, just more of a worry at the time about um, her expression. And she looks a lot less um, demented. Uh, in person, uh, in a in a really weird way. She looks more natural. Yeah, she looks more natural. Um, her eyelashes, one of them is up and one of them is down. You can kind of see right there, in her right eye. But I can fix that. Oh, she looks wonderful though. Comes with a hairnet and everything, and her wig actually too. From other uh, in person videos I've seen and in hand images, um, the hair looks really really good still. So um, again, there's a terrible glare on my window. Sorry about that, but. There is Tiffany out of her box real quick. We're gonna go ahead and move her to the side and then we're gonna open Glenn real quick and then take the plastic wrap off, whatever. All right, let's get Glenn out of here. Let's cut this a little safer this time, I, I guess. Whoa, cutting into the cardboard a little bit. Scoring it. I can do this, okay. Puzzle. How many of these did they make? Uh, they're going to make more. Uh, Tiffany is number like 1,453 of 5,000 and Glenn is number 687 of 3,000. Okay. At least mine is. Yours is going to be different. More of the same stuff in here. More of the same stuff. Again, packed super, super well, but... Yeet. Uh... Reverse your Rooney here. All right. all right. Same deal. That's actually lucky. You didn't plan that at all. All right, and real quick again, with just with the plastic wrap and everything, brand fresh new, as new as it's ever going to be. Here's Glenn, right out of his shipper box. And he just looks wonderful. I don't think he has a hairnet actually on, so that's interesting. Um, not that like it's bad or anything. I just wonder what, what constitutes when they need him and when they don't. Uh, I'm not bothered at all. So, oh. 
He he really really looks wonderful. I can't believe I can't believe uh, how good he looks and I still Cannot believe that they actually made this the fact that they actually got uh, The license for C to be able to make a Glenn. I mean, uh, you know NECA had to pull like just a little baby Glenn from the Bride of Chucky 2 pack so uh, the fact that we actually have anything at all is beautiful all right, now we're gonna take a look at Tiffany here, just more up close and actually with the plastic wrap off. And again, like I said, her eyebrows are a little muffed up, but again, I'm sure I can push those up and it'll be fine. Again, her facial expression's looking a lot better in person, so. Again, no review aspects. Hopefully I'm trying not to, uh, gonna talk about them too much in this, because I'm gonna make full reviews on them. Again, I'm gonna take some time. But the packaging is wonderful. They do have the portraits on both sides. There's Glenn as well. But I think Tiffany looks wonderful. Detail on her tattoo, everything, just right out of the box from what I can see right now. I'm really, really, really liking her. So, really excited to crack her open. I think she's going to look absolutely wonderful. Again, just the tagline down here, collect the whole family. Like, I just, I really can't get over the fact that these exist. I, I can't believe that I own these. These are like Chucky dolls. Um, and the fact that I actually own these is, is freaking crazy to me. So, um, I'm just uh, so thankful they actually got to make these. Um, again, they got to actually make a Glenn, so uh, here is Glenn. He, again, he looks wonderful. I, I have to be honest, um, right off the bat, I will get into this more in my review and I'll see how it stands when I actually take him out. But um, out of looks, like as a prop replica, compared to all three of the dolls, um, I think Glenn is the most accurate. I think he's the best in that regard at least. But again, I'm gonna crack him open. Um, just the facial design and everything, like he just looks absolutely beautiful and creepy his hair looks wonderful his outfit and everything but just the face design the colors and everything looks so so perfect so so yeah I, I basically I'm gonna be taking these guys out of the box later tonight taking my time over the weekend get a feel for them I'll get them reviewed uh, earlier next week so keep an eye out for that if you have any questions about something specific uh, any type of questions you have about these dolls feel free to leave them in the comments down below and I'd be uh, happy to answer them in the review um, so yeah thank you guys so much feel free to check that out when they're out and uh, hopefully you enjoy them hopefully you guys have got your shipments in and everything and uh yeah i'll see you in the reviews thank you for watching